So this is this abandoned mansion. Look at it. Absolutely huge. That is massive. Look at that. What a beautiful view they would have over this area of mountains. Look at the pebble outside, rock outside. Some of the rocks have come off, but that's pretty. Wow, look at this. That's a ginormous home inside, isn't it? Adam was saying that this place was abandoned and uh, was only built in 1975, so I don't know why. Don't know why it uh, didn't didn't stay active or didn't have uh, active ownership. And look at that; it's got this beautiful staircase. And uh, love these archways. It is very European decor. Uh, what's left? Look at this enormous heating flue, I imagine that would be. I think that would be for the heater, which would help heat the entire home up. So there's the floorboards, everyone, for the upper structure. All right, here's a view of the top floor of this Swiss chalet here in Utah. And there's that heating flue again. You'll see it goes right outside the building and all the way through to the ground floor in here. This house would have had the most beautiful view of the mountains of Utah. So it's a pity that it's um, not in a real great condition, considering that it was only built in 1975. Looks like a child's size armchair. Here's an old uh, caravan over here on this side. Quite a large looking caravan too. I really wondered what went wrong with this house. Why was it abandoned after it was only built in 1975? What happened to the owner? Did they simply run out of money? Did something sad happen? Did something sinister happen? I'd love to know your thoughts below. If you like this video, then please give it a thumbs up, please share it out to your friends, and of course subscribe if you haven't already.